Hey, got a call about a big alligator in a small pond. So I figured I'd grab Jimmy and Mike. We just roll over. Hey, how's it going, guys? How you doing? The alligator in there. He's in there? Uh -huh. Yeah. We just got back from a vacation, and we noticed a huge alligator in our He's pond. He's massive. Huge. Yeah. Massive. Like yeah. six feet. Eight feet. Uh, I'm going bigger feet. than that, probably 12. It's yeah. probably yeah. nine to 10 feet. Um, you can see him every once in a while, pops up here and there. But he, the don't, he, doesn't, he doesn't stay up, though. No, no, we haven't, we seen, haven't just... seen him up for a long time. Just yeah. periods comes up, goes back down. Have you seen down. him today at all? Or? I seen him earlier this morning. Yeah. That's when I called him, and then he alerted you guys, I guess. I'll hop in and look around for him. And, uh, what do you mean, you're going to hop in the water? If he doesn't come out by command, it's usually the best way to find him. You're not going to hurt him, are you? No, we're not going to hurt the alligator at all. I'm more worried about the alligator hurting us. <laughs> There's the bubble there. The bubble? Oh, there he is. <laughs> that thing's huge. He's 10 plus. That's a big boy. Katie, come back here. Come on. Yeah, you might want to stay on, away from the water for a little while. You're going to need a bigger boat. I mean, the way I look at it, uh, 11 foot alligator, me, a PVC pipe, what can go wrong? Yeah, nothing? No. Good luck. That gator gets a hold of you underwater, it's over. He grabs a hold of your head, your arm, he's gonna spin it off like a twig. Hey, hey. We got a lot of bubbles right here. Is that Paul or is that the alligator? Most people get freaked out when he's doing this. Paul can hold his breath for, what, about three minutes? Oh, wow. That's why I don't do it. I can hold my breath for maybe 30 seconds. I mean, I went in the water at first and the water seemed pretty clear, and I thought it would be a real easy catch, and it ended up turning into hours. I'm just in the water going inch by inch looking for this. It's a big alligator. He shouldn't be hard to find, but he's, he's, he's becoming real elusive. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, Paul, hey. He's right here. Paul, right here. Oh, my, see him. Don't move. Stop pointing. Stop moving. Stop yelling. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, Paul, hey. He's right here. Paul, right don't here. Don't, like, see him. Don't move. Stop pointing, stop moving, stop yelling. He stayed down as long as he possibly could. And when this guy came up, it was like a whale breaching. He just broke the surface. You could hear this big exhale, and he was trying to get some nice big breaths of air. So that's good. You got him? There he goes, there he goes. Jesus. And I, I thought I could have stuck that rope up. He went down and back, so it, I couldn't really get him. Technically, he was on land for a second. You should have jumped him. When I get the noose on him and almost had him, now he's a lot more spooky because he knows what I'm about. He knows I'm not his buddy. I'm not just some guy swimming around. I'm coming to do damage. I thought he was actually going to come up on land. I thought he was. You have him? I had him around both jaws. He got off. Big gators are usually easier on land or in the water. They're more confident. Usually, you can get up on them in the water, slip a noose open with your hand or the or the little pole. He was spooky. I got next to him. He took off and stirred the whole bottom up. Oh! Oh! oh, oh. He finally popped up on the other side. I put the noose on him. This is pretty intense, huh, girls? Yeah. He's gonna go nuts. Yeah. As soon as he rolls around, he's gonna... This alligator, he was heated up, he was pissed off, and he did not want us touching him. Well, make sure he doesn't go through the water. alligator wrestler I've ever seen. And he is very valuable to me. You want me to jump him? Yeah, get on him. He'll ruin your day. That's good. Oh, 
was easy. Hey, the girls want to know if you're going to come over and hang out and do the zip line. Yeah, okay. absolutely. I'd love to do that. That's cool. And maybe you guys can do it too. Sounds good. I'll try it. <laughs> Do we want to thank Mr. Paul? Thank you! You're welcome. I felt like I was 10 years old again. This pond was out of this world. I've never seen anything like it. Paul and I have two different personalities. Sometimes we butt heads, but I'm very glad to be a part of Gator Boys. I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world.